To the NBA, the Detroit Pistons fired head coach Monty Williams yesterday morning. Williams was in Detroit for just one season, and it was a rough, rough one. The Pistons won only 14 of their 82 games. The Pistons now owe Williams the $65 million remaining on his contract. Of course, he spent time here in New Orleans from 2010 to 2015, coaching the Hornets and the Pelicans. ESPN is reporting that the decision to fire Williams came from ownership, which would mean former Pelicans GM Trajan Langdon, who left New Orleans to be the Pistons president of basketball operations in May, did not make that decision. And of course, with another head coaching vacancy, Pelicans James Borrego is mentioned once again as a potential replacement for Williams in Detroit. Yahoo Sports is reporting that Borrego will be strongly considered in the Pistons hiring process. Another Pelican staffer already left for Detroit when Fred Vinson was hired to join the Pistons staff last week. Vincent had been here in New Orleans with the franchise for 14 years. Christian Clark, who covers the Pelicans for NOLA.com, put into perspective how big of a loss Vincent is for the team. That's a big loss just in terms of he was a shooting guru for the Pelicans, helped Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball, Herb Jones, a bunch of different guys with their outside shots. They're going to have to make, you know, two to three hires on the coaching staff alone, and that's not even in the front office. I think, you know, one of the bigger picture questions do they just have to play the guys who have natural shooting ability more next season? I mean, I, they played a lot of the defensive-minded guys off of the bench this year, and they, they were really good bench unit, but at the same time, didn't get up as many threes as they wanted to. That's going to do it for a look at sports. Hope you enjoy the rest of your Thursday.